Well, it's not the news we hope to hear on Thanksgiving weekend. A new COVID variant has been discovered in South Africa. This one has some health experts worried. The Biden administration already restricting travel from seven African nations beginning on Monday. WPTV News Channel 5's Matt Sesney has more about it and reaction from air travelers. At PBIA, the early arrivals back from Thanksgiving were only starting to hear the news. Popped up on my phone. Daddy and Megan Sedan came home from a visit to Maryland and hearing about the new COVID variant was discouraging. This is absolutely awful just when we think we've kind of gotten through another phase of this and we're, we're moving into the light. Her sentiments were felt on Wall Street, where the news was met with a huge drop in stocks and oil prices in just a half day of trading. This definitely is concerning. Infectious disease specialist Dr. Larry Bush of Wellington says this new variant called Omicron after the 15th letter of the Greek alphabet was discovered in South Africa. And like other variants, airline travel is expected to spread the variant. So the more people that the virus can find that it can replicate in, the more it will mutate. Now, this is the most mutant virus, this strain that we're talking about now that's been found so far. Health experts say the Omicron variant is more transmissible than previous variants. What isn't known is if the new strain can get past the current vaccines used to fight COVID. I was thinking also about the boosters. OK, well, will these boosters also cover this yeah, sure. uh, variant strain? So hopefully crossing our fingers, yes. yes. Most health experts say vaccines and boosters are still a good idea since it appears, they say, the virus tends to mutate and change more in the unvaccinated. In West Palm Beach, Matt Sesney, WPTV, News Channel 5.